And welcome back guys, Gvids here. Uh, today we're back on story mode. And uh, since online is basically died right off, I thought it'd be a good time to come back into story mode and just do some of the stuff that I haven't got to do. Um, I bypassed a lot of the stuff when I was playing. Basically it's just so I could get ready for the online part. and I skipped a lot of the side missions and bounties and basically all the smaller stuff of the game. I just stuck to the main missions. And if a side mission got in my way, then I tended to do that way, but very rare that I do any. So I'm going to come back and try to showcase some of these bounty hunts. Uh, there, This was pretty fun. This guy here, he's not like one of those badass killers or nothing, but he definitely needs to be taken out. He's been going around and poisoning people with fake tonics. And that is just not very nice. I know my Arthur does not like that kind of stuff. And we're going to go and take this mofo out. Well, we might not be able to kill him. Sometimes they want us just to uh, bring the guy back to jail. So that might be the case for this guy. Mr. Benedict. $50 we're going to get for this capture. It's not a whole lot of money, but back in that time, hells yeah, that was a good chunk of change. Alright, Arthur, let's go and get this guy and stop him from killing all these innocent people. Where's my damn horse? Come here, horsey. There she is, looking pretty like always. Alright, so let's get this run on here. I'm not going to bother showing you guys all that stuff. I don't need to draw it out any longer than it is. So let's go and find this Mr. Benedict. Alright, we finally made it here. All these spots are highlighted on the map, so I'm not going to bother showing you them. You, All you have to do is start it and you will know where to go right where to go so I don't have to show you the locations or nothing but once you find this guy just walk up to him and give him a little talking to now if he offers you something make sure you don't take it because uh, those tonics there I couldn't imagine they're gonna do you any good Cause this guy don't look like a killer not like most of the killers I would think that we're going after when we do bounty hunts Arthur looks more of a killer than this guy does. But hey, he's a he's a crooked mofo if he's taking people out with these nasty tonics. So we're just gonna chat with him here and Yeah, he is real sick. You ain't helping nobody, buddy. All you do is kill people. Ah, uh, Arthur, I wouldn't drink that if I was you. Yeah, that's what I thought. Throw that shit off the edge and let's go. You're coming with me, bud. I don't want to hear your jibber jabber. Get on my horse and we're going to go and talk to these police officers. Folks get real angry for no good reason. Now don't hey, hang on there. Don't be going too close to that edge. Come here, buddy. Just tosses his gun over. Why wouldn't you keep it, Arthur? I would have kept that. Put that gun right in my pocket. Oh shit! I got you, bud. Don't fall. I need to bring you to jail, not kill you. Come on, Arthur. Get him up there. Use those muscles of yours. Oh shit, we lost him. He's down there. He's going for a swim. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry, bud. I didn't mean to drop you. I was trying. Come on, Arthur. Let's go. We'll take this guy's horse and uh, go retrieve him. Looks like a fox trotter. What do we got? Half breed or whatever it's called? That's all right. Fox trotters are uh, definitely my favorite horse, so can't wait till I get mine online. Probably go do that now soon, I think. But anyways, uh, let's continue chasing this dude. 
before he gets away on us. Because he's moving awfully fast. Come on now, oh, horsey. Let's go for a little swim and get him. Ah, shit. Hold your breath, buddy. Come on, horsey, let's go. Get down there and get him. I'm glad the horse can swim well. Come on, let's go. Oh, shit. Oh, there goes that horse. Alright, we're on foot now, guys. <laughs> let's go, Arthur. He's just down the river. So once I caught up to him here, I'm going to get this dude, pull him out. Okay, maybe not. Let's try again here. There we go. Bring him in, Arthur. So we can get this guy back to jail so we can get paid and... Keep this guy off the streets. Not only in it for the money. You're one nasty dude. <laughs> I love when Arthur comes in, just gives him a good solid punch, just to shut them up. We don't need to hear their jibber jabber. Of course, you gotta rob the guy. Now, where's my damn horse? Come here, dumbass. Where are you? I guess dumbass is my online horse's name, but all the horses to me are pretty stupid and they frickin' never listen to me. Especially on this, uh, when you're on the story mode, when you go too far from them, you're on foot till you get back to her. Well, I'm just starting my jog and I'm just gonna kill these guys and take their horse. Make sure you throw your mask on if you're gonna do anything like this. So you don't get yourself into trouble with some bounties, otherwise you'll have bounty hunters after you, instead of you being the bounty hunter. Get one of these horses before it runs away. Perfect. Alright, now we can make it to the sheriff's office. Get this guy up on the horse there. Come on, Mr. Benedict. You are going to jail, you piece of crap. That's what you get for when you're killing people, especially women. The guy was going after women too, sick women. What a stupid son of a bitch. Well, Arthur's taking him back and uh, we'll get her $50. Watch out, horsey. Hopefully this guy doesn't wake up and start jabber jabbing at me again. Oh, there he is. Give him a smack, Arthur. Oh, shut him up. Alright. I don't think this is too far away from us here, so we'll just get this guy over there so he can stop killing people. Oh my god. Those NBCs always almost take me out. It's like they see you and they purposely try to cut you off with their damn horse. I don't know why they do that to you. But you think you can skim by them, then a guy turns in front of you and end up going flying. And this horse is very tired already. Give him an apple or something, uh, Arthur. Jeez. It's not my horse, so I don't care if it's tired. Alright, so we made it back into uh, Valentine. That house is almost built. I almost just want to sit there and watch them build it and see the progress they actually make on that house. It's pretty cool. Anyways, we're back at the sheriff's office now. Let's get this son of a bitch back in jail. So you can stop hurting people and stop giving out some poison. Get him in there, Arthur. Oh my lord. I wasn't expecting you back so soon. Uh, Mrs. Caldorf was uh... Where would you like him? Right inside the cell? It doesn't really look like much of a cell when there's like a, another door right there. Well, that's one more bad guy off the street. Thanks to our good man, Arthur. He's going to be going out and getting a lot more of these bounties. Hopefully they can get a little bit more ruthless and uh, we can use our gun on them. 
they don't have to be brought back alive. But anyways guys, I really hope you enjoyed this. This is something new for me, something different. So uh, again, I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, make sure you like and subscribe, and I'll catch you on the next one. Peace.